Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading up 120, NASDAQ up 157, S&P's up 37. Gold, gold contract trading down $5.80 at 19.10 an ounce. We have silver up 3 cents, $21.96 an ounce. Light sweet crude up uh, 4 bucks. Big hit there, $70.88 a barrel. Notes and bonds, a 10-year note. Down 26 ticks at 113.27. The 30 year up full point plus 20 ticks at 129.30 and King Dollar. King Dollar uh, trading flat, 103.598. We have the Euro out here at 107. And the Yen's at 134 and the British Pound is at 121 to 1 US dollar. Let's get over and take a look at the E-minis here. So you've given up quite a few points. I suspect you're gonna give up more and I'll share because right now when we came down that first leg, you get a high volume low that's laying down there that wants to get tested. So if we take a look at it, the, the number that I'm talking about here is at 39.13. Give it 27 right now, bottom line, expect that's gonna hit. We'll see how this shakes out. You know, bottom line, you were all the way up to 39.72. And if you just look at it with, if the market just closes here, the market didn't do anything. That's the bottom line. When in fact, it looked like it was like a monster move. Or, well, it was a monster move earlier. The S&Ps almost, well, they, they actually went up right to the high of yesterday. I think they missed it by a quarter. Now they got it over by a quarter. I think, you know, this is the future we're talking about. Bottom line, folks, you're still in a bear market. You can see how fast, fast bear markets can give it back. We go and look at the gold contract up here. Gold's holding up well. Uh, you get the gold contract up here. You're backing down with 244,000 contracts. That's a good number in the back down because it's kind of just going steady, going sideways rather. And then if we go into the U.S. dollar, we take a look at the dollar. Dollar right now, you know, not much movement. Yeah, you're basically flat on the dollar, 103.590. That's where we're at right now. Um, you know, you get a lot of support at the 103.056. Uh, we'll see how this shakes out. My take is that the dollar still is going to get up to this 106 to 107 area. Stay right there, folks. We'll be coming right back. To recap out here, we have the Dow Industrials up 142. NASDAQ is up 164. S&P is up 38. And uh, uh, volume-wise out here, uh, bottom line is that uh, you had monster volume coming out of the market yesterday. We did $1.5 inside the uh, NYSE. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.